What is up my shred heads? Welcome back to the channel. Right now I'm headed to the post office to mail out the first giveaway package to Insta Wilbur. Where are you going ladies? Come back. Hey. And thanks to everybody that entered. There'll definitely be another giveaway coming up here soon. So check out what happened yesterday. We're gonna go back in time. Well, it has finally happened guys. We're gonna have to see if that armadillo works that I put in that tire. So let me get something to pry that out. And that's a big one, dudes. Shot a lot out. <laughs> Leave it down here for a few minutes and then we'll repump it and see what happens. Guys, it actually worked. I just pointed it down for a little bit, pumped it up one more time. I pumped it up to like 29 psi and all of a sudden I heard it stop leaking. Looks like armadillos is pretty good stuff, guys. So the Armadillos has been holding up pretty well. Let me pull over really fast here and let me show you guys. There it is. See that? Let me put a little bit of spit on there. It's gonna be gross, but. See, nothing's bubbling up, nothing's filling up. So it's holding. We're gonna go on a, a nice long ride today. I'm gonna keep it on, on mode four. And uh, we're gonna just do a few tests also on mode four, see how much battery we lose. We're gonna go do a little 360 video down that road that has the big wind turbine. That's gonna be pretty fun. Um, do you guys wanna ride through some grass really quick? Cause I do. Yep. Yee yeah, this is fun guys. This is a lot of fun. I'm just scared of gopher holes. Don't wanna hit a gopher hole. Oh. All right, that was a lot of fun. <laughs> Set up this little bumpy trail. Whee! Whoa, oh, oh. That was nice. All right, they stopped for me. Let's ride in the streets. So we're, we're staying on mode four the whole time to see how much uh, percentage we lose. All right, we're at 99% right now. Been holding full throttle. It's a super hot day today. It's like 95 degrees, pretty humid. So it looks like we lost 3% and we've traveled 0.4 miles. And we're going 31 now. We're going in a slight uphill though. Hey, thank you guys so much for leaving all the comments down there, down below on the last video, helping me with uh, my mic settings. I have it on setting two right now. Um, so just let me know down below if it sounds as good as you thought before. I also appreciate everyone uh, Giving me tips too down below in the comments That's what I love about the YouTube community. Everybody's helping each other out. It's not only uh, You know you guys asking me questions. It's me asking you questions and you guys informing me as well So that's why I love doing this We all learn from each other. It's great. So we've went a mile and lost 5% on full throttle. All right, let's get ready for another cheesy music video. We're gonna keep it full throttle to the end of this road and we'll check where we're at, all right? Here we
crap guys i hope you guys enjoyed that one that was fun um so what did we do we went uh two and a half miles so far uh full throttle uh now we have 88 percent left so and then let's see how fast we go at 88 percent see if we still hit 32. now uh, we're still around 31 at 88 percent we're going a little bit of, of a downhill right here so yeah we're on 32 right now let me slow down like I always say, if anybody's around this town, like the town of Lewis, and you have an e-bike and you want to go for a little group ride, you want to try this out, um, just leave a comment down below. Uh, follow me on Instagram. Just send me a message through there. Because I definitely love going on group rides and trying out different bikes and letting people try this out. One day I'll own a house down there, one of those little houses. That's it. That's all I need. Except for my girlfriend. She'll need like an underground bunker for all her clothes. Hopefully this armadillo holds up. Uh, I do have a pump, so I should be all right, because if it does leak, it might just be like a slow leak. Good yeah, morning. Yes, bacon, egg, and American. Same old, same old. Caramel. Yep, thank you. You're welcome. Appreciate it. Yeah. Oh, what did you guys expect? Frappe. All day. Yee, let's go to my spot. Enjoy this beautiful view while I eat some breakfast, share it with the birds. What's up, my friends? Oh yeah, let's see how the tire's holding up. Let's check out the pressure. Oh yeah, PSI's. El PSI. I think I was at 28 or 29. 30 PSI. Somehow I got more. But no, it is actually holding that pressure pretty well. Let's take it down to 29, because that's... All right, we'll keep it at 29, just to see if it holds. I'm just keeping a nice higher pressure, just to try to get as much of that stuff to plug that hole up as possible. I don't hear my birdies above me. Let's check out the sandwich. Let's check out this bacon, egg, and cheese on a croissant. Oh, yeah. Oh, heck yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. So usually I feed my the birdies like this part of it, you know? Man, I love a good croissant. Unless we go croissant. Yeah, I got you, dog. Here you go, bro. Here you go. Just get it right there. There you go. Oh guys, remember I told you the brake was rubbing? That was totally wrong. What happened was one of these little screws backed out and was actually rubbing somewhere up in there. So that was what that noise was. So make sure these are always tight when you change them out. I messed up. All right guys, we're just gonna continue with the full throttle test. We're at 86%. We've gone 4.3 miles on mode four. So let's cruise, see how many miles we get out of this bad boy and make sure we don't get a flat. So we're at 85%, we're still hitting 31. Heck yeah, that's awesome. Beautiful garden. America, woo! Ah, uh, it's so hot, but this feels so good. Guys, check out this little, little shack. Wouldn't you just wanna hang out there like all the time? Look at that little place. It rolls. And this one too. I just want to hang out there. Hey guys, let me just buy that. I want it. I want to live right there. It'd be sick. <laughs> I don't even want one of these big houses. I want one of these little shacks. And a boat. A boat. An e-boat. Yeah. <laughs> Hello, what's up dude? Just gotta watch out for the popo. Check this out here, guys. That's an osprey nest up there. So there's a bird there, and then two birds in that big nest. How cool is that? I hope you guys can see it. Big old birdies. Wow, that's so cool. Should I ride through the grass again, guys? 
I know you guys like doing it too. I know you guys like it. What are these dudes doing? Are they making a rope swing? <laughs> yep, this is mad fun, guys. Mad fun. Mucho fun. Try just sitting down. Oh god. Full oh. throttle. Always let go of throttle whenever you hit these things. Oh wow, that's actually like that was a fun little bounce. <laughs> yes. Oh, that thing looks cool. I want to ride up on there. I know security's going to get me if they see me. Huh. Oh, yeah. yeah, that's what I wanted to do. Can we go back up it? We sure can. Alright, let's roll out of here before I get in trouble. Though. See ya. We're at eighty percent now, guys. Six miles. E plane needs to go out there. Super seventy three. E plane. We need it. Electric Ultra Glider, Super 73 branded. This is the best view. The best view ever. We're at what, 79%? We went six and a half miles. Let's see what happens at the end of this road. The Fox 31 still at 78%. Not bad, not bad, guys. This hub has been acting perfect. I've had no mishaps at all, no weird sounds, nothing. And I put it on myself. I'm so happy. Back from the dead. All right, once I get back into the town, I can't go full throttle until I find like some back road. So let's go to this back road where all the cows are at. Oh, we'll go full throttle there. I'm still going 30 right now. 77%, that's not bad at all. Not bad at all, it's not bad at all. All right, here's the cool back road, we can gun it. Um, maybe I'll try something a little bit different today. Uh, we'll do a second little cheesy music video uh, with the 360. And I'll just see if I can try to freestyle some acoustic guitar stuff over it um, while I edit it and see how that sounds. It might sound horrible, but hey, let's try things. Let's try new things, you know? Let's try different things. It's always good to explore every option out there, even if it's not an option. All right, uh, we're gonna do another full throttle test. We're at 74%. Uh, We've gone 8.7 miles. Another cheesy music video brought to you by Shreddy.
right guys that was a pretty epic long road so now we've gone 10.8 miles and we're down to 67 percent so and that was at full throttle so that wasn't too bad um and that was non-stop on this road so we're just gonna ride back um full throttle again not get killed by cars there we go all right full throttle all the way back guys oh we're gonna visit some cows too oh and i forgot to show you one more thing one more thing yeah so that's all the sun i've been getting all the sun i've been getting Getting nice and toasty, just for you guys. And we're gonna go check out some cows here in a second. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys have any suggestions you guys want me to do in my upcoming videos or any questions about the bike or fixing anything on the bike or with what I've done recently. Uh, just let me know, because I'm here to help you guys and I'm here for you guys to help me also. I love this little curve right here. It makes me feel like I'm a motorcycle race car guy or a motorcycle racer. Yeah, it's a blast. It's a blast. We're at 61% now. We're going downhill a little bit, uh, going between 29 and 30. But, oh, look, cows, our friends. Our friends. Hi guys. How are you doing today? You're big dudes. Wow. Hi cows. How are you? That's a little baby. So cool. You guys are tired. You guys tired cows? Wow, this is like concrete. So cool. Hi. How are you doing? See you cows. We're gonna continue our range test and our armadillos test. So far, so good. I don't feel any flats. Scooty Magooties, what's up? Yeah, scooters. I think he wishes he had this instead of that scooter. Who wants to pay for gas anymore, you know? All right, we're at 59%, we could only go 29. That is a definite. I think we're probably gonna get between 28 and 30 miles total. So um, at 55%, we're getting 28 miles an hour only. Um, I guess not only, oh, we just hit 29. Let's ride on the side, just uh, We'll like pretend we're pedaling. 26 mile an hour pedaling. That guy doesn't want to do 25. All right, I'll let him get pulled over. Okay, so we're at 53%. We're still hitting 29. Dig it, yeah. Oh, puppy. What's up, doggies? I think by the end of this road, we'll probably have like 49% maybe. I don't know. I might be wrong. Made it to the end. And like I said, 49%. That's awesome. So we've reached the end. 49% at 15.6 miles traveled for 49 volts. All right. I guess we're going to do the same thing on the way back. Same thing, full throttle all the way back. Yeah, those Quest Kayak guys are awesome. If you guys are ever in the Lewis area, make sure to hit up Quest Kayak. They have so much awesome, fun things they can bring to the beach for you. Kayaks, they have those floating mats that are like little islands you can just chill on. It's super sweet, I love it. They also have like sheds on like places all around, like on the beach or 
Oh, just everywhere. And they give you the code, you open a shed, get the stuff you need, get your kayak out. Once you're done, put it all back, lock it up, and you're good to go. It's a pretty sweet deal. Looks like we're still going 28 with 48%. That's what that's saying, this saying 30. And just remember, this is full throttle, not much uh, feathering of throttle. You're good, bro, that's cool. That's cool. All right, we're almost back to the beginning of this road again. All right, 17 miles down to 45% from 99. Full throttle. All the way. Forgot I got a bike. Oh. Get you here. Whoa. Almost got killed by an ambulance. No better person to get hit by, right? 44% still hitting 28. Uh, the homies. And don't forget, Lewis Cycle Sports, they run out e-bikes, so when you're down here, I'm thinking about renting one out and just uh, trying it out and see what I think about it. Be pretty cool. All right, guys, I just dropped off the giveaway package, and uh, normally I don't lock my bike up like this, but since it was a quickie, I just put it around my, my front wheel. Normally I would put this around my back wheel and part of the frame and then I would put like a U-lock around this part of the frame and then, you know, somewhere on around one of these rails. All right, guys, we're going to check the tire pressure again. And we're still holding a steady 29 PSI. Oh, wow. Still holding the seal. Don't feel any air coming out. And we're still at 29 PSI, which is great. I'm stoked. Armadillos. That is a good backup plan, guys. Just remember, always carry a pump with you. Neat bike. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah. All right, guys, so we're down to 42%. We've gone 18.1 miles. I can't go full throttle right now because this car is going slow. 28 miles an hour at 41%. Cool old historic houses around here. If you guys do get a chance to visit Lewis, just drive around all the old neighborhoods. They're really cool looking. Look at this place. Hasn't been changed since like 1960, 50. Short people live there. Yeah, nothing beats cruising around on an e-bike. Hey, I kind of stopped there. 39%, we traveled almost 20 miles. From 99%. Just a little, little jumpy jump. Remember, no throttle on your jumps. So look, we're at 38% and we're still hitting 27. 28. 28. Still going 28 at 38%. Look at that house, that place is cool. See, I listen to the Nullis people. It's like a witch's hat. You, I appreciate the, I think I've had like five people buy bikes now through my Talkable link. So, greatly appreciate that guys. It's helping me out quite a bit. I don't know if you guys have ever heard of like house tours, but they have house tours around here and a bunch of these houses let you go inside and check them out and they tell you all like the historic stories about the house. It's pretty neat. And they actually have like uh, ghost tours around here around Halloween, which is pretty fun. It's awesome hearing those crazy stories. And uh, check out this like old little historic, I don't even know what to call it, it's like a little old historic neighborhood or something but it's pretty cool I have no clue what they do or even do here but it's neat I like it it's cool because one of these was like an old schoolhouse I think it's that one 
an old outhouse back there. Just to go poop. I have no clue what that little house is. That thing is small. Wow. Whoa, what's that big thing? What is that thing? Cool, an old well. I wish I knew more stories about this place for you. For you guys. They just started building that. That's pretty neat. No clue what it's for, but I like it. Sometimes they have like a farmer's market around here. It's pretty cool. All right, back to full throttle. We're at a 35%. We've gone, oh God, 20 miles. And so far, so good with the armadillos holding. I don't think I need to buy a patch kit. I do have two new inner tubes coming on the way. Also tuffy liners, so I'll do a video installing the inner tubes and the tuffy liners for you guys. And then I'm gonna get another bottle of the armadillos uh, for backup. All right, we're gonna go again full throttle on this road. We might just go full throttle up and back a few more times or I might just keep doing circles. We'll see what happens. But let's enjoy this beautiful view for right now. Oh, let me stand up. There we go. Comment down below. Let me know what you guys think, think about this awesome view. If you'd like to be here and uh, join me on a ride sometime. So relaxing, guys. All right, we're at 29%. We're still getting 27 miles an hour of full throttle. Don't know if you guys can see that or not. Golly, I can't believe how big that is. It probably looks so small to you guys, but man, it is huge in person. I do this for science. Science, baby, science. All right, now we're going only 26 with 28%. We're going like a slight uphill. Now we're going slightly downhill. Back to 27. There's like some sort of dog park back here. Unleashed dog park. Whoa, it's pretty big. Wow. All right, so if you guys uh, ever come to Lewis and have a dog. As bad as I want to go down there. I don't know. Don't know about the ticks, my dudes. You guys know I love ticks. Somebody needed to come here and hit that thing on an e-bike. That would be so rad. Super tight. 25% battery life. 23 miles gone. 20, oh, something was dead and it smelled really bad. <laughs> oh, I tasted it. That's disgusting. Again, 23 miles, 24% left, going 26 miles an hour, 24 volts left in the battery. And we have only gone on throttle this whole ride, full throttle mostly. It's been a kick-ass day so far, I've been having a great time. Quest dudes, I guess you can run a kayak and go in there, that's pretty sick. That's awesome. One day, guys, I'll, I'll ride through a cornfield. One day, guys. All right, guys, we're down to 21%. We've traveled 24 miles. We're going 26 miles an hour. We hit 27 because we're going downhill right now. We're down to 21 volts on the battery. So that's not bad at all. I could make it to Bethany to my buddy's house, charge up in his shed while we go fishing, and I can drive back home. That is sick. This thing gets a pretty good range on full throttle, guys. We're at 17% now, so I think we'll be killing this battery pretty soon. All right, we made it to 15%, 25.7 miles, and we were still getting around 26 miles an hour. So we're getting pretty low, guys. Getting really low. Oh yeah, I can tell it doesn't have as much power. And it feels like so far the armadillos is holding. We'll check the tire pressure one more time when we stop. 
25 miles an hour at 14%. 26 miles traveled. 99% battery we started with. Man, I can't wait till that second battery releases. That is going to be great for all of us. All of those little sewer jumps. Oh, we're at 11%. We've gone 27 miles and we're still hitting the 20s. 22 miles an hour, 20, 23. Still hitting 23 miles an hour with 10% battery left, guys. Those are some cool, cool trucks that way. I'm pretty sure when I hit 8% last time, like I had no throttle, like at all. We're at 9% right now, 9% battery. Still hitting 24 miles an hour. Armadillo is still holding good. The dude from Armadillo's is actually gonna send me four more ounces in case this doesn't hold up. So we're just pretty much testing it out and see how it does. But so far so good. All right, yep. Now we just hit, we're still at 9%, but we got to a point where we can't hit the 20s anymore. We're only hitting 18 right now. So, okay, I thought we were gonna hit like 30 miles. We hit about 27.4 but it can still get us places let's see we'll see we'll keep on going up and down this road and see what happens all right we're at seven percent and we're going about we're probably gonna hit 14 maybe we're at 13 yep now we just hit 14 miles an hour come on get out of my way Ow. I can fit. I think I can fit. Yeah, baby. I didn't have to pull in my mirror. I didn't have to pull that bad boy in. But I did. Wow. I can't believe we're still getting throttle like 6%. 18 miles an hour. 6 volts left in the battery. 28.6 miles traveled. Shit, boy. So let me know what you guys think about the range test and um, if you guys want me to do the 70 miles, see if I can get 70 miles on level assist one, be tight. Oh man, come on, we got this. 6% guys. Can we get 30 miles? One more mile, guys, with this 5% left. Come on, we can do this, guys. We can do this. My, my phone's overheating. Oh. Oh, no, I've never seen that. The battery. It's done. It's done. Come on, guys, we can do this. We can do this. We're still going. Oh, it keeps going back and forth. I can feel it like kicking in and kicking out. Giving us throttle again. Barely, barely. But man, this battery gets hot. Really hot. I wonder if there's like something you can like put over it to keep shade on it or something. Oh no. I think that's it. That might be it, guys. You can do it. You can do it. I wanted to get 30 miles. Oh boy. 29.4, man, you can't beat it. You can't beat it. Yeah, so I think it's safe to say on full throttle you get 29 miles. Because right now, like, this doesn't count as anything. This little bit of, yeah, it's like a little weird bouncy bounce, 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 bounce. All right, time to pedal home. All right, guys, so almost 30 miles done on that range test. 
and 30 miles on the armadillo's tire sealant. And remember, it was at 29 last time we checked the tire pressure. Let's see where we're at now. How did we get more tire pressure? That's so weird. But I mean, look at that. It's still holding its pressure, guys. Could be the heat, too. It got really hot. The tire feels really hot. Let me take it down to 29, though. Just leave it there. 28 and a half. Leave it there. That's fine. But man, the armadillos did a hell of a job. Pretty stoked on that, guys. 30 miles on it. No leaking. But he's going to send me a little extra product just to put it in there to make sure. But I really don't think we need any. That's, that's working pretty pretty darn good guys comment down below let me know you guys think about the armadillo's tire sealant and uh i'll put a link down there below for it uh you can buy it through the one-stop board shop link i have and you can enter code shreddy when you check out to get five percent off all right guys that's going to be an end to my video i hope you guys enjoyed it as much as i liked making it uh, make sure you guys hit that like button subscribe and make sure you hit that notification button to be notified when i'm making more videos and again, like I said, comment down below. Let me know if you guys have any pests that you want me to do on this bike. Um, thank you guys for, uh, so much for helping me grow my channel. Thanks everybody that uh, entered the last contest. I think I'm gonna have a, another contest when I hit 500 subscribers, which actually would be pretty soon. So uh, just be on the lookout for that and make sure you follow me on Instagram, everybody. And also if you guys wanna do any kind of group rides with me, if you come around the area, just uh, shoot me a message on Instagram and we'll definitely hook up and I'll let you ride this bad boy. And also, if you want to help out the channel, make sure you, you click those affiliate links down below. We've got the Huck Cycles, Tag Form, One Stop Board Shop. Soon I'm going to get a, um, the Super 73 affiliate link down there. And again, congratulations to Insta Wilbert from Instagram for being the first winner of my giveaway. And pretty stoked how the armadillos held up. Like I said, I'll, I'll put a, a link down below. and. Um, I definitely recommend doing the armadillos just as a backup, even if you have the Tuffy liners, because it seems to be holding pretty well by itself. But I'm still going to do the Tuffy liners and do a little install video and show you guys how to do it, okay? Another moment of silence for that subscribe button. Are you guys ready? All right, I'll see you on the next ride.